Pleased to be joined with Jaguars tackle and first round draft pick Anton Harrison. Anton, welcome to 1010. Welcome to Jacksonville. How's it been so far? It's been great. Uh, it's been an easy transition for me. A lot of guys on the team helped me out, so I, I love it out here. You've been here a few weeks so far. What's the most fun thing outside the stadium that you've done? Uh, I'd probably say just going to the beach, like having the good weather. Being from D.C., you don't got a lot of beaches. Then going to Oklahoma, you don't really got this type of weather out there. So going to the beach is chilling out there. I was going to say, you were landlocked for a couple of years there. Are, <laughs> yeah. I know you're from the DMV. Are you a beach guy? Is there, uh, is that, was that a part of your routine growing up? Uh, we went, like me and my family, we went a good amount of times. It was something we loved doing. So that's something definitely I love going and enjoying. On the field, how has it been now having the veterans around you? Has there been a couple of veterans who maybe have taken you under your wing and have really showed you the way of the NFL? Uh, it's been good. Uh, it's been smoother than I expected. Um, having the veterans that's here helped me out. Brandon, Cam, Walker, all the guys, Josh Wells. So all of them just helped me out, take me under their wing, and just coming out here every day trying to get better day by day. What's your relationship been like with Cam and Walker, the other tackles on the team? Uh, it's been good. Uh, Every time I have a question, I go to them. I, we talk outside the facility, uh, try to do things outside. So it's like easy brotherhood came in. They took me under the wing and like a family already. You have one other rookie who was drafted to play offensive line and uh, Cooper Hodges. Yep. I hear he's quite the character. When I've interviewed him, he's quite the character. Uh, can you give us uh, some, what's your favorite Cooper story since he's arrived here? Uh, I'd probably say just every day. Cooper, he's a joke guy, so. Uh, he always come with a crazy joke, um, so all his jokes be good. That's one thing. Just, and then where he's from, he's not he's from not too far from here, so everybody be making jokes about where he's from. Him, <laughs> so I probably say just that, just being around him. He's a good uh, good person to be around. I definitely say that. And how does Rousher fit into all of that? <laughs> uh, he, I feel like he's a great leader, a great teacher, but he's not so like uptight. He's cool, chill, wants us to just have fun with it and get better. So I feel like just having that in the room is a good thing to help us improve and grow as O line. I know he's told us that with you, you know, you're still learning multiple positions. What positions are you honing in on right now? Uh, right now, I'm really just trying to focus on right tackle. Uh, that's really the only thing that have me playing right now. So. Just getting better at that every day and practicing that. And, of course, the dead period is soon to be upon us. What are your big plans for your first, quote-unquote, five weeks off in the NFL? Uh, Me, I just kind of want to just get better, obviously take some days off, go back home, see family. I know they're going to have a lot of questions. Uh, so just be able to chill with family, have fun a little bit, lay back a little bit, but also knowing that what we got ahead. So just continue to get better, keep working out. I was going to say, have you, has your mom one of those? She texting you every day or what's what's the, the relationship? Yeah, me and my parents, mom and dad, we talk almost every day. So we all close. They always have a lot of questions. Um, my mom, she the one. She's not going to text. She's going to call. So <laughs> FaceTime or call? She going to call. She might do both, but mainly call. So we're going to be on the phone for a little minute. So my mother one of them. So it's always good just talking to them every day. So, yeah. Awesome. And you're still in the hotel right now? Have you found a place to live? I actually found a place um, not too far from the beach. So good, good area. Uh, getting all my furniture, things like that, getting chilled into Jacksonville. I was going to say, you're going to miss the hotel, though? A <laughs> little bit, a little bit. It gets old over time, but a little bit. Tank said he loves that they make your bed every day. Yeah, hey, <laughs> that's very true. Make your bed, you got clean towels and wash clothes. So that was a bonus. Now I got to wash my own clothes. <laughs> awesome. Anton, thanks so much for the time. Yeah, I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you.